I'm about to show you. I'm about to show you he don't hear your prayer. This John chapter 9, verse 31. Hold on, let me bring this out to you, brother. Yeah, bro, it ain't nothing that you can say to me. Why you not Look, letting me Malachi, read the scripture? I'm going to pray for you. Let me read this out. Oh, run, you running. I'm going to pray for you. you running. I'm not running, but John chapter 9, verse 31. My prayers hit heaven. Now we know. You gonna run Hold up. Now one we know day. that I'm God heareth right not now. sinners. But if any man right be a worshiper of God to do of His day, will, and, and you gonna know that. So but I'm Lord, telling you, it's the Lord don't hear sinners. I'm not a sinner. You are a sinner. You court. You shame your face, so you are a sinner court to the body. And that that that's the whole. You gotta come out of those churches, cause that's some worship. Now you worshiping white Jesus. You need to come out of that, brother. You think it's a joke, bro, brother? The Most High is bringing judgment on the earth. You don't I'm even pretty know. sure you see it. World Bruh. War Three brewing up. People getting put to death Bruh, left and right. Famines, earthquakes, I just pestilence. To you. And, and, and my word. These are I the signs come. of the times, brother. And if you don't get yourself right and acknowledge yourself to be an Israelite, the Lord going to show you, brother. I'm not an Israelite. You're not an Israelite. So no. what are you? I'm a Gentile. You a Gentile? You that you are. A lot of here. Brother talking about he a Gentile. Damn right he a Gentile. Right. Let's go to the scriptures. All right, because you got a lot of these Christians that believe that God loves everybody. And Jesus Christ died for everybody. This is Acts chapter 5, verse 29. Then Peter and the other apostles answered and said, We ought to obey God rather than men. God of our fathers raised up Yahweh, whom ye slew and hanged on a tree. Him hath God exalted with his right hand to be a prince and a savior for to give repentance to Israel and forgiveness of sins. So the Lord gave repentance to the Israelites and forgiveness of sins for the Israelites. It don't say for the white man, the Chinese man, the Japanese. It don't say for those who want to go to church, shuck and jive with pork chops in their hands, shave their face. And that brother was really feminine too, man. Right? And I ain't even go that deep with the brother as far as in the scriptures. But you can already tell by that brother, his countenance and his spirit, don't bear witness with the Bible. I'm trying to go to different verses. The brother don't, don't want me to go to the verse. I'm bringing out John chapter 9, verse 31. The brother want to run and flee. Hey, but the scriptures say the wicked flee when no man pursue it. That's in Proverbs chapter 28, verse 1. All right. Hey, brother. Hey, brother. Hey, brother. You know you're an Israelite, brother? No, I'm saying you're an Israelite, though, brother. God shows the people. Right? But that's why the scriptures say two thirds have to get put to death. That's in Zechariah chapter 13, verse 8. Because they know not, neither do they want to know. They don't want to hearken and consider their nationality. They consider that God don't love everybody. They consider that God only loves the Israelites. And the so-called white man is going to slavery. Hey brother. Hey brother. Hey brother. Hey brother. Brother. You know your nationality? You said what? No way. All right, brother. All right. You don't want me to get away from him. It's all good. That's what the Lord's going to say in that day. When Jake is dying from a famine, getting his ass judged and jacked up by a nuclear missile, that's what the Lord's going to say to him. Get away from him. All right? I know you not. Matter of fact, let's get that in the scriptures. This is Matthew chapter 7, verse 21. Not everyone that saith unto me, Lord, Lord, shall enter into the kingdom of Yahweh, of heaven. But he that doeth the will of my Father, which is in heaven. Many will say to me in that day, Lord, Lord, have we not, we, like, have we not prophesied in thy name? And in thy name have cast out devils? And in thy name done many wonderful works? And then I will profess unto them, I know you not. Depart from me, ye that work iniquity. So that's what the Lord is going to say to that man. He just told his brother, get the hell away from him. And all I'm trying to do is enlighten the brother and give him his nationality. But that's the stiff neck and rebellious nature of the so-called black man here in America. It's a damn shame. All right, so with that, I'm going to give all praises to Yahweh, Shemiah, Shah. Say Shalom.